Hello guys, I'm gonna try and show you how to use your phone to soft mod your Xbox. Well, I have not had much luck to use 360 Explorer to copy saves. I'm gonna try it one more time. If it doesn't work, I'm gonna use this USB stick here, which works on the Xbox. I'm gonna copy the saves over on the Xbox uh, to this phone. And then I'm going to put the image on the internet so you can use the image uh, instead of using the phone. Well, you're still using the phone, but you don't have to do this part yourself. First things first, you do need your USB adapter for the Xbox. Kind of obvious, but yeah, you, it, it, you might not find it that obvious. Okay. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to create an image and call it HH or something, I don't know. Size 16 megabytes doesn't really matter either. And then go to partition table, keep that in there. And this can be none. So if I go to create now, so I'm going to go to create, it makes an image. Then I'm going to go, uh, now I'm going to go to settings. I'm going to go to USB settings. By the way, I'm going to Disable this real quick because this might annoy the crap out of my Xbox. Okay, I'm gonna put the USB mode on mass storage. So I'm gonna put it on mass storage. And this one's off. And my USB system is standard Android kernel legacy. Okay, so with these settings, keep awake, I'm gonna keep that on too. With these settings, I'm going to go back, back. I'm going to put the image. I'm going to host it on the bottom most one. So now it's hosting. And when I flip this switch, it should pop up on the Xbox. If it didn't stick. So yeah, it crashed the Xbox again. This seems to happen more often. So I'm going to reboot it real quick. Now that we're back on the MS dashboard, I'm going to go to memory. And now it works. As you can see, it has been erased. So we got our own little memory card. I'm going to call it coded. Just because I like having things called coded. Coded. There we go. And well, 2D is also fine. Done. Okay, we got our stick. Now what I like to do is now I'm going to eject the disk by simply switching the power button again and taking the phone. Now time for my laptop to shine I guess. It's uh, apparently still booting. Go to drive, open, hard drive or memory card and it shows up. Oops. Well, I did not like doing that. Whoops, 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 whoops. Uh, let's delete this whole crap. Delete, yes. Okay, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to go to D, release, going to the Xbox soft modding tool. I'm going to go to the soft mod package. And I'm going to take the number folder for the soft mod package, and I'm going to throw it into this window. As you can see it's copying over now. And I'm gonna do the same thing with the splinter cell folder. I'm gonna copy that as well. Like so. And um, well that seemed to go quicker than uh, it should have gone. Oh well. Let's, let me throw this out. And plug this back in. See if it's still there. Close. Open, hard drive, partition. Well, it still shows up, so it's probably fine. So now I'm going to unplug this. I'm going to plug it into the Xbox. Well, with it plugged into the Xbox, it should show up again. Except when it doesn't and your cable's not really in straight. Okay, there we go, it's plugged in. And if we check the memory unit, oh, if we check the memory unit, it should 
find our saves. There we go. So what are we going to do with these? We're going to copy them over to the Xbox hard drive. And I'm going to pick up the soft modding tool. I'm going to copy, going to copy that as well. What I'm going to do is I'm going to check my bookcase for a splinter cell. This is the disc. There are two, the, the classics versions of Splinter Cell does work. What I'm going to do is I'm going to take the disc, move this a bit to the side. I'm going to plug it into the Xbox. There we go. Turn off the Xbox. I don't need the uh, USB stick anymore, so. Trying to read the disk now. Shows me the Microsoft logo. And uh, stop defocusing you. Okay, there we go. Well, now that it's loaded the game, what I can do is now skip the little intro. And I can go, can go to start game and I can select Linux, go to levels or checkpoints, whatever, checkpoints. And we have booted in our soft mod.